Hey ladies, it's Tracy from KISS and as you can see my braids are gone. Ooh, yes, I wore them exactly four weeks. Let's see, my last relaxer was February 14th, Valentine's Day. So I have tons of new growth. It is very tamed and controlled right now, but trust and believe it's in there like, ah! So I will be relaxing either this week or next weekend. I will post a picture here. And basically this picture is of my hair after I took my braids out, I washed it, I deep conditioned it, I detangled it and it had air dried. And after it air dried, I basically just put it in a very messy bun finished my housework and then right before bed I did my braids for a braid out. I was able to go from that to this. Just very simple, not difficult. I have a old video that I show how I do braid outs on, you know, hair that has a lot of new growth or hair while you're stretching. Because if you guys know in the past I have stretched longer than like six months. So yeah. But I will definitely put the link in the description box so you guys can watch that video if you need tips. But yeah, this isn't the neatest uh, braid out. <laughs> it's almost like my hair needs to be retrained because it was in the braids. I will tell you this though. I noticed a huge difference from the last time uh, I wore braids and took them down years ago before hair journey and now because it was like just taking the braids out the, the hair itself was just so soft and moisturized and then when I got to my hair it just got even better so when I washed and deep conditioned it my hair just feels amazing like that's why my braid out looks so messy because all day long I've just been like just my new growth is soft and so manageable and definitely tell the difference on using the braid sprays that doesn't have mineral oil in it and all that other junk in it and you know, using that every day. And I had got to the point where I was taking my Elastic Humango Butter and just running it over the braids. And I absolutely, absolutely loved it. So, yeah. Definitely check out that old video. And if I don't relax my hair in a couple of days, I'll go ahead and do another braid out. And I'll, I'll film an updated one for you guys. And that's it. As far as taking my braids out, the only thing that I can tell you when you're taking your braids out when you're taking out weaves the most important thing is to make sure you detangle because when your hair is in braids what happens to your shedded hair is it stays with it's trapped within it so when you take your hair out sometimes you'll see it right where the braid was sometimes you can't so you want to make sure when i would take each braid out i would take a din man brush and i would just pull it through that section to remove any trap shedded hair the reason why that is important is because if you don't do that and you just take all your braids out or your weave out and wash it i have seen it so many times where when they get done their hair is literally matted together like literally so it is very important to before you wash it to make sure you detangle all that shedded hair out or you it it, it can be bad to the point where you will have to cut it and you can use a fine tooth comb for that or you can use something like a Din Man brush. That is it. God bless you. I will be back very soon to do a update and lift check when I relax my hair. See you on kiss.